So in this video we are going to make a real life Jarvis using python, uh, LLM from olama.ai and also we are going to write a script for speech recognition that will capture and recognize the speech very very fast as compared to normal speech recognition module. First we are going to olama.ai and downloading olama. Once olama is downloaded, open olamasetup.exe and install it. Once it is installed, install our LLMM model. There are different models from which you can choose but I'm going to download Llama 3 which is very capable model of Olama. You can choose any other model by clicking on models and choosing a model which you would want to download. To download a model, just copy the command given on the website and paste it into your command prompt and hit enter. It will automatically download the model. So first, let's make our speech recognition module for our uh, AI. In the description below, you'll find the necessary code. Let's briefly walk through what's happening here. First, we have our voice.html file. This web page utilizes either web speech recognition, which is right here, or speech recognition to capture and recognize spoken words displaying the recognized text in a paragraph on the page. It returns continuously updating the paragraph with the new text each time it recognizes a new speech, replacing the previous content. So now let me de demonstrate you how it works, uh, so I'll open Chrome here. So you'll find two buttons start recognition and stop recognition, when I'll click start recognition, it will start recognizing what I'm saying. So hello Jarvis, how are you? Please tell viewers to like, share and subscribe. So you can see it's working great and it's way faster than our normal speech recognition module. So the next we have our speech recognition.py file. So before you run this code you have to make few changes here. First of all you need to make sure that you have installed these two modules. You can use these two commands to install the modules by copy pasting them uh, these two commands in your terminal or command prompt. So after that you have to right click on your voice.html file and click on copy path reference and from here you uh, can copy the uh, path of your voice.html file after that you have to paste it right here okay so our speech recognition.py file this script scraps the voice.html web page and extract the text from the output paragraph so now let me de demonstrate you how this works so i will run this file So once it's print listening, it means it is listening. So Jarvis, how are you? Please tell viewers to like, share and subscribe. Can you please tell me the time Jarvis? Okay, it's working perfect. So now let's write the code for our Olama AI and integrate it with Python. Okay, so here we are on our PyCharm and we are going to write code for our Olama AI. So first I'm going to make a new file. I'll make a new Python file and I'll name it Olama AI. I'm going to add it in my Git repository so you'll get the code in, uh, in the link below of my uh, from my GitHub. So first I'll import the Olama module. So I'm going to write here the command from which you can download the Olama module. So next I'm uh, from our speech recognition.py file which is right here I'm going to import this speech recognition function. Import speech recognition and also I'm going to import my driver here, which is right here driver so I've uh, from speech recognition module uh, my dot I have imported speech recognition and driver the next we are going to make a def main function so in this function first I'm going to make a client so client will be equal to olama dot client so next I'm going to get make a drive block 
in this try block i will run a while true loop which will run until we manually stop the code so now we're going to get prompt so prompt will be equal to the speech recognized by the speech recognition function and after this i'm going to write print recognized text is wrong so i'm going to print it so to make sure that it is printing the exact same text which i'm speaking next we can define which model are we using so in my case i'm using llama 3 so if you're using a mistral or mixtral you will write the model name which you have downloaded and you're using here so i'm using llama 3 right now after that we have to get response from our model so i will make a variable response so response will be equal to client dot generate so model will be equal to model and our prompt will be equal to prompt the next thing is text so now we need our text response because this response is like array is an array so but we need our text response so i'll make a variable text response which will be equal to response dot get res response after that i'm going to print a yeah. response is my text response great now finally i'm going to make a final find the finally driver dot quit so I'm going to call my main function here. So here, yeah, our code is done. I'm going to add one more thing here. I'm going to import my py. So, but let me make it more short. Um, from py ttxx3 import speak. I am going to say here with print speak text response okay so our program is done now i will demonstrate it in the next video and i will also discuss problems that some people may face until that you should execute olamaai.py file and check if your ai is working correctly if you are facing any problems comment down below and i will discuss them in the next video